What would Wayne Rooney fetch on the transfer market if Everton ever decided to cash in on their greatest asset? Kickoff at Highbury and four ahead of Chelsea, who are beaten 4 2 at Charlton if they beat Everton here today. Everton starting this game in 12th place. Campbell's excellent header finds Rooney. Will take on O'Shea. Waiting for support to arrive. Hibbert on the overlap. Here's Leetin. Jemba Jemba and Phil Neville's outstanding run of form. That's the best way to press his claims, all right. Here's Rooney. Everton finding themselves a goal down yet again. Gravison. Here's Rooney. The run by Gravison. And he re the free kick the challenge only scored six in eight matches on opponents grounds before today and managed just one clean sheet brilliantly won back there by O'Shea the combination of uh, Rooney and Hibbert have still presented but full credit to Everton they're working incredibly hard closing down at every opportunity trying to uh, make sure that United don't have too much space to play in Lee Tier. Rooney back to Linderoff. Just left. That's a little unfortunate. Just the call up into the England squad, such as his form has been, but uh, really need to be alert there. As Ferdinand needs to be now. Well, you would have expected him to need to be alert, but Wayne Rooney made it a bit too easy for him. Cue the abuse from the Manchester. But He's scoring goals for England, of course. Tier. Linderoff. He's found a bit of room here, Rooney. Only Campbell in the box. Others arriving now for Everton. At half time. But Manchester United are possibly the most dangerous team in the country when it comes to scoring goals late in each half. And to rescue anything from this game, Everton. Have to uh, and Rooney It's very difficult when Everton have to throw the ball forward as early as they just looking for Rooney down the line. Respects because uh, We've seen him in games where he just would have gone charging into that particular situation, give him make the first move, and then make sure that he brought the clearance. The man who's just fouled him. Oh, and that is silly. That is very silly. Understand how Cristiano Ronaldo earlier, you know, he showed a maturity, didn't he, the other end of the field where he didn't go diving in on Quinton Fortune. And this time I think he's thinking, well, I'm going to make amends for me mate here because uh, Cristiano Ronaldo just lashed the ball into his head. He can't do that to one of my teammates, so I have some of that. And in return, he's going to get a yellow cup complete. It really is a wild and a rash challenge. And of course, all it's done is put his team under further pressure now. Well, this is where he has to learn, doesn't it? I mean, he's nowhere near the ball. Well, we all know he's got a short cues. He's got to show a greater maturity. And I think this is something that David Moyes is constantly on in him about, and of course, well, uh, when, he, when he gets with England. Goal separates the sides. He had to try and control that on his chest there, Ronaldo. And Rooney quite happy to dispossess him and then give it away. Against Manchester United, and you are in trouble. They're already losing the game. An hour gone. The booze will tell you who's in possession. Not many teams come back from 3-1 down at Old Trafford. Rooney clashes again with Ronaldo, and this time counts to 10, or 5 at least. Well, this is a big moment for this youngster. You know, he hasn't been at his best, it's been a difficult season for him. You know, he has a defender. Meanwhile, to the Manchester United fans' delight,